Understanding of position from a lifetime of just all grappling, judo, wrestling, uh, sambo. He does it all, and he has just so many ways to get you to the floor. This guy once told me that if he can get your leg, he's going to finish. Right. Because he's going to give you so many things to think about, you will not be able to process and keep up with him, and eventually you're on the mat. It's unbelievable to watch him apply that knowledge to the mixed martial arts fight. And as the wrestlers say, this is not a guy you want anywhere near your bracket. No, you don't want him in the bracket. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts, Bruce Lee, is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. And now our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Both fighters are 31, with some differences in height and a similar reach. Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon is Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. E Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 146 pounds. Fighting out of Sunbury, Pennsylvania, Bo Crusher. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting at Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. This might be fun. side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Oh, that's a good strike there, by the way. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. And that one certainly found the target. Just out of range with that strike. Circling away towards the left now. Right on the button. And they separate. 
That one stuck in. Nice strike. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the two. Oh, and there's a takedown attempt there, DC. I'm no analyst, but that one was pretty telegraphed, not his best effort. Yes, he may as well have sent a text message to his opponent saying, I'm going to shoot the moment the fight starts. Of course, he got defended. Set up your attacks, young man. Oh, thought he might have had that head kick, but just out of range. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. Good jab. Leg kick. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Oh, countered there with an uppercut, perfectly placed in time. Big powerful punch land. Now he gets back to range. You don't know when that leg kick is coming. Oh, nice job by him to get the knee to the target there, using his length exceptionally well tonight. Look at him with the hip and that kick. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. Right hand upstairs. I mean, you cut them down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. Big punch land. Ooh. And they separate. Ooh, and he caught the kick. Beautiful kick. Oh, strong uppercut forward there. That'll get his attention. Now connects with a right. And both guys really throwing with authority. Real quick leg kick. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Looking for the inside leg kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? He is all about that left kick to the body. Wow. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Combination lands for him. He is really putting his strikes together tonight. I mean, he's feeling himself tonight, John. He's doing a great job of putting everything together. These guys are going at it. Nice punch here. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Oh, big head kick there. Wow, what a kick. Huge kick lands. Oh! Beautiful body kick lands right under the elbow. So a strong five, five minutes five, down. Five. Right now we check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. How about the display of striking? Just high level. I mean, you would think that we're watching a K-1 level kickboxing match opposed to being in the UFC. Both displayed great technical skills, unbelievable striking. All right, so the next round is underway. Will it be more of the same? And by that, I mean all of those strikes to the body. You've got to think at some point the opposition is going to lower that guard or get finished. And that's exactly what he is hoping for. All those great body shots, all that damage he's putting on his opponent will force an opening up top where he will look to finish. 
Oh, and there's that head kick. He kept talking about the opening that would be there on Thursday. Those words proving prophetic right there. I mean, his vision and his timing allows him to get that technique off. Big punch in the middle. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, but unable to land. And he continues to work the body here. Just unable to quite find that range. That was lightning fast, that right in. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes it. Stop doing it. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night at that landed. And he connects there. Blocks the shot. Goes back to that left kick once again. Oh, big left hand there. Man, doesn't take a lot of these kicks to produce redness. Look at the left side of his body there. Nasty. Attempts the front kick there. That right hand hurt him a little bit. He gets hit with a kick. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block a shot. That's incoming. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, oh. no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the whole platter. <laughs> Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found the set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Oh, that's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike. He's very effective with it. Got the single follow tie. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Lee going for the leg kick. Nothing doing there. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Takedown defense holds up. There's no give on that leg kick. Nice stupid punch. Get him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Nice kick. Oh, spinning back He didn't telegraph that one at all. Nice leg kick land. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Beautiful straight punch there. His boxing fundamentals are just so clean. Oh, he looks so sharp tonight. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Such a fast leg kick. Come on, buddy. And he connects there, DC. Great job, man, in that one. Let me see that one. Ten seconds. And he gets touched by that kick right to the body there. Nicely done by the opponent. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work.
All right, so the kicks to the body, certainly the big storyline in that previous round. DC, take us through the replay. He did a fantastic job of finding his spots. He was sneaking that kick right up under the elbow and landing those nasty body kicks. He did a great job of recognizing a weakness in his opponent's game and really taking advantage of it. All right, the action continues here and now as our next round gets underway. The previous round won't be confused for a round of the year, but pretty good action. It was a pretty good round. Not every round is going to have you standing up out of your seat. You understand that you are watching the highest level of fighting in the entire world in the UFC. out of range with that left hook. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. That's a really strong leg kick there by Lee. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. That's a big strike right there. You gotta check these low leg kicks. Back and forth we go. Big body kick. Oh, tags him with the left. That is an educated left hand. Educated left hand. He's throwing so fast, so crisp. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Punch his block. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Back to the feet. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Big head kick. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. And he landed the right hand there. Three minutes to go in round three. Can't take many of those, you better check. Way to hide that leg kick. Man, look at the redness now, almost immediately on the right side of his body. Oh, spinning back fist. Just missed with that right hand. Your opponent has you in the clinch, pulling down on your head, landing punch after punch. You have got to clear that collar tie, reach back inside, and try to find space. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Look at the whip action. Get him. Oh, spinning back fist lands. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Nice punch there by Lee. Man, he's timing the shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing that Tom Brady. Stop. John, stop. Stop. <laughs> His opponent still stands. I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. Big kick land. <laughs> Spinning back fist. Didn't see that one coming. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Looking for that left hand, just missed. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Big kick lands. Whiffs on the right hand. 
20 seconds now remain in the round. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Seconds winding down in round three. Ooh, big shot lands. Oh, How about oh, those God. five minutes? Stop. All right, well, that's the end of the round, so the location is okay, the cut on the cheek, but that is some serious blood trickling out of that cut there. You gotta think maybe at some point they call the doctor in, and if he doesn't like what he sees, maybe they stop this fight. All right, let's check out some of the action from that previous round, DC, and what a display on the feet. Huge knockdown with that kick. Yeah, he's a high-level striker. He throws these kicks to the body, he throws them low, but when he goes up top, he's very powerful, and he can end anybody's night. The toughness displayed by his opponent allowed him to stay in the fight, but he cannot take many more of those types of strikes. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Gotta find a way to move those feet. Well, just as he did the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Big kick lands. Beautiful body kick. Punch coming, it's blocks. Nice punch there by Lee. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Nice body kick. Big head kick lands. Nice kick. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Single collar tie now. And there comes the separation now. What a punch. There's no tell on that leg kick. Slip and counter by Lee. Oh, nice. That strike blocked by Lee. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Nice leg kick. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Big kick. And now his opponent in a world of trouble. Beautiful level change. Make him think you're going low and then come right over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great punch. Good punch, Lance. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Nice body kick land. Trying to land the elbow there to no avail. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, nice knee by Lee. Big leg kick land. Connects with the right. I mean, look at the commitment to kick in this fight. Lands the right hand. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. And they separate. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Lee gets caught with that punch. Right under the elbow, the body keep playing. How about that shin? Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots.
Nice head kick. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Oh, wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. Work continues to be low. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Oh, straight right. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect. So fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land anywhere. Buzzer sounds for the end of round four. 20 minutes in the books. All right, there's the end of the round. So it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of there. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands. His opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what, what you want to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round. That last round. You need to be smarter. Technically, you're a better striker than he is. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we go, fifth and final round. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with a the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Leg kick. Diggy kick. Wow. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down, though. Circling towards the left now. What a punch. Powerful leg kick lands. Just out of range with that right hand. Look at the turtle in that kick. Oh, well, now you really are starting to see the damage inflicted by the opponent all over that left thigh. Sound defense there as he blocks the shot. Beautiful leg kick thrown. All right, single collar tie now. Just out of range with that right hook. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Beautiful strike. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Ooh, looking to set up the head kick, but he misses. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Back and forth we go. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Caught that. No, there's danger in that too, because when you start reaching out to catch that kick. Wow. Less than three minutes to go now in this fifth and final round. Oh! Oh, he gets up. The question is for how long? And they separate. Beautiful punch. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Big leg kick land. While the body was wide open, his opponent took advantage. Kick to the body lands flush. He's going to have to make some adjustments here moving forward. Leg kick. Oh, huge block. Great punch. Lands the right punch and follows it up with a nice left hand. Nice sequence there by Lee. Oh, look at the welts all over that right thigh. Really starting to bruise now. 
Oh, nice kick right there. Tell the masses how how good that feels to get kicked like that. John, it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, and Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, worked hard to get up again, but he looks like he's compromised. 45 seconds remain in the round. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. He's done, he's done. Woo! A near perfect strike to end the fight and end the night for his opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming. So just the way he drew it up, exactly what he told us during fight week played out here on fight night. He found a little opening in his opponent's defense and barged right through it to get the big knockout win. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is what they will be talking about for quite some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop for this contest at four minutes, 19 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon. Well, we congratulate him on a huge knockout here tonight. He'll probably keep that smile while he's sleeping tonight after what he was able to produce here. He's going to be smiling for a really long time. When you get a knockout like that, not only do you get the win, you also, most times, walk away with a $50,000 bonus check.